mystery of stuff. Working on a fishing boat or on an oil rig in the middle of the ocean certainly comes with quite a bit of adventure. The men and women who work in these professions not only have to worry about what's going on with their ship or oil rig, but they also need to worry about what's going on in the water around them. These experienced oil drillers thought that they'd prepared themselves for just about anything. But when they looked out into the water, they realized nothing could have prepared them for what was quickly approaching. For the workers that were on the oil rig that day, it was a morning unlike any other they'd had before. They were in the Gulf of Thailand, about 130 miles away from the shore, and the day seemed to be going along as it normally did. That was until workers realized that there was something strange floating in the distance. One of the oil workers noticed something bobbing on the water. When they took a closer look, they quickly realized that there was actually a dog in the water paddling through the waves. The workers immediately knew that they had to do something to help this relentless canine. The workers began to call out to the pup as she made her way to the oil rig. When the dog finally reached her destination, she climbed to safety on the rig's metal bars. Once she was out of the water, the oil drillers lowered a rope down to the pup so they could pull her onto the boat. Luckily, the drillers were in the right place at the right time or this story would have had a terrible ending. After she made it onto the bars below the rig, she didn't cry or bark at all. We looked for a way to help her and in the end, decided to use the rope to tie around her body to lift her up explained Khan. While some of the drillers helped nurse Boonrod back to health, others welded her a special cage. Boonrod slept on the platform of the rig for two nights. Soon enough, another oil vessel arrived and used a crane to bring her to a veterinarian in Thailand. After giving her some water and a bit of food, the drillers radioed for help to request a tanker that was heading back to the shore to pick her up. When we first took her on board, she was depressed and tired from being in the water for so long. When we gave her water and minerals, her symptoms improved, recalled Khan. No one knows how Boonrod made it out to sea, but one theory is that she fell off a fishing boat. We found her trying to swim towards our rig, which is about 220 kilometers, that's 136 miles, from shore. Thankfully, the sea was quite still because the wind was calm, said Khan. Khan Vitasek, the one who saved Boonrod, said that he would be more than happy to adopt her if her owner doesn't step forward. Before she left, the crew named her Boonrod, which roughly translated to Survivor, or The Saved One. Considering the circumstance, they couldn't have picked a better name. The pup is currently being cared for at a rescue center in Songkla, southern Thailand. <laughs>